Look at this hand. Do you see this hand? Do you see? Do you see this hand? You need to listen. Look at this hand. Look at this hand. Okay, now don't, don't, don't look at my hand. Look at the light, okay? Don't look at my hand. Now look at Snorlax in your glass eye. Closer or farther, alright? Closer or farther away? And closer or farther away. Okay. Now look at the eggs. Look at the eggs. Look at the eggs. I'm just gonna shake them on your face. Just for fun. <laughs> Hi! Hello there! Hi! I'm your doctor. Yes, the rumors are true. I am, in fact, your doctor today. How are we doing? Yes, indeed, I do specialize in the big toe and examining the big toe specifically. That's what I studied at Dr. Bill University. Oh, what do you mean I'm three hours late? No, 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 no. We're on my time here, okay? So I hope that you were relaxed while you were waiting, but yeah, that was the time that I decided I was going to show up, so I hope that's okay with you. You look upset. Let me give you a little bit of medication to calm you down. Just one moment, okay? Okay, just take some of this medicine. It'll calm you right down. What is it? Oh, it's just some cough syrup. Just... Perfect. Now, for your own personal safety, I'm going to have you move back a little bit close to me, quite frankly. So, for the beginning of the exam, I'm gonna have you move back. And when I examine your feet, and specifically what you're having a problem with, your big toe, once we do the cranial nerve exam on that, I will move you a little closer. So, move these little feet, move these toesies, move these piggy wiggies, okay? Just go back. Okay, that is much better now. I feel like I can breathe. I mean, they were a little bit stinky, but you said you might have an injury to your toe, so that definitely could be why. If you haven't cleaned it a little bit, it may even be rotting. We'll have to check it out, but hopefully it'll be okay. Okay, so I am your professional doctor. Like I said, we're going to start by just, just checking your vitals. So let me see. Let me take a look at your face first. I'm gonna put some pressure. Mm -hmm. A little bit of pressure. I'm gonna check all your vitals, things like your heartbeat, your eyes, your ears, things like that. Mm -hmm. Let me just let me feel your abdomen area. Okay. Just press around and around here. Mm -hmm. Right here. No, this is not a massage appointment. I'm checking your area for any pain. Please, 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 please act appropriately. <laughs> okay. Let me check you right here. Let me check you right here. And let me check your toe really quick. So let me see that little feet. See, I'm gonna go... And let me check this one. Is this where the pain is? Is this where the pain is? Right here? Okay, let me just squeeze it and let me know if it's painful. Is this painful? Okay. Is this piggy-wiggy? Is this piggy-wiggy? This one. So this is where you are having the pain. That is why they called me the professional toe doctor to inspect you. So let's listen to your heartbeat. Just relax. No need to be nervous. I'm gonna just take this and put it right under. And breathe in and out. In and out. In and 
and out. Good. Okay, your heartbeat is a little bit fast, I'm gonna be honest, but you might just be a little bit nervous to see me. It happens a lot. <laughs> oh, who are these little guys in the back? These are not stuffed animals, these are my assistants. Why would you call them stuffed animals? They're obviously living, breathing creatures. They are my assistants. I used to have more of them, but some of them got fired because they were a little bit incompetent. But now we have Snorlax. Snorlax, you want to give him a kiss before we continue? Right. Snorlax. And we have Mr. Cowtato. He produces potato milk. It's so very good for you. Very nutritious. Trust me. So I'll put him right back here. Now let's continue. Now I need to take your temperature. I'm going to do it two ways. First the bottom. Just turn around. I'm just gonna and let me do this with the light. Ooh, hot temperature. Let's try it again. Thirty-six point nine. Sorry, I thought that was Fahrenheit and Celsius. Okay, you're fine. You're gonna be okay. Don't worry. You might have like a minor toe infection. It could be causing like a tiny, tiny bit of a temperature, but I think overall you'll be okay. Let's see what else we're gonna do. Let me take a little look. See. Let me take a little look, see in your throat. Open your mouth. Open your mouth and go. Uh, put this here and. Oh, why am I sitting on the floor down here for the exam? That's how we're professionally trained as toe doctors. Let me see. Yeah, your tonsils are a little bit swollen. Do they hurt? They don't hurt. Maybe they're just normally swollen like that. I don't know. Let me look in your eyes. Okay. Let me look in this eye. Don't worry, we're going to be testing it again when we do the cranial nerve exam. Okay. Alright, let me look in your ears, please. We might have to do an ear cleaning really quick. Look at this one. Yeah, we need to clean both of your ears. This is very serious. We need to do it right now. You probably can't even hear me right now. Okay, so I'm gonna take your ears. Let me see. I'm just gonna. There's a little birdie in the background. You hear the chirps? I hope not, but he's in the back. He's a little annoying, but that's okay. We can always just. Have some bird for dinner. Okay. First ear. And let's see. Let's get the other ear. I know I should have put my gloves on to be sterile, but that's okay. It is what it is. You already probably have an infection anyway, so you're fine. Your ears. Look at how wonderful. I mean, look at how dirty. Okay, so I need to get your ears clean. I'm going to take this light tool and just just like this. Relax, relax, relax. Okay, let me get the other one. Now let me see. Just clean your ears. Very dirty. Oh, very, very dirty. You're gonna be able to hear something better after this. And let me just spray a little serum. Okay, now that's not for anything, that's just for the smell. Um, can you open your mouth? Go, ah. Uh, 
Yeah, that was also for the smell. <laughs> Just a little, little stinky breath, but that's okay. We fixed it with the spray. <laughs> now let me look in your ear one more time. See. Okay. And let me look in this one. Your ears are a lot cleaner now. Yeah, you can thank me for sure. You can thank me with an extra tip if you want. I know you're not supposed to tip your doctor, but you can actually tip toe doctors. Yes, 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 yes. It's different. Since we are a different kind of medical professional. Here, let me put your ears back. Let me just fuse it back on. And... Okay, we got that back. Now let me see what else we're going to do. I'm going to do a few tests. I think we can start some sort of cranial nerve exam on you. So I'm going to just dim the lights a little bit. Just give me one moment, please. Just Okay, now that the lights are a little bit dim, I'm just going to start by testing your eyes a little bit more. So, let me see. Oh, you did not tell me that you have a glass eye. Let me take that out. Okay, well, I'm going to test your good eye, okay? Here's your glass eye. I'm just going to tap on it. It makes a really good sound, honestly. Oh, don't worry. I won't lose it. I'll just put it somewhere really important. I'm gonna put it on Snorlax. So let me get my light. I have two different kinds of lights. I'm gonna start with this one and then I'll move on to this one. Okay. So okay, just want to observe your eyes really quick. Hold on. Let me see. Let me just get a little bit closer. Right, so I forgot you only have one good eye, but you're still gonna have to follow it with your eyes, the light. So I'm gonna take this light, this light right here, and I'm gonna shine it in your eyes, in your eyes. So follow it, follow the way with your eyes, with your eyes, sorry. Ready? Follow the light with your eye, please. Okay, you need to listen. You need to listen so we can perform this properly. Follow the light up and down, up and down, up and down. Okay, in the center, follow the light. Oh, silly me. I should have put my gloves on to start the cranial nerve exam. Give me just one moment, please. I completely forgot. We could be spreading your germs everywhere. Hold on. Let me just get these gloves on for your safety and my safety alike. Okay, now look at the light. Look at the light. Now look at my hand too. Can you see my hand right here? This hand. Not this hand. Look at this hand. Okay, look at this hand. Back here. Don't look at the light. Look at my hand. Look at cow tato. This hand. Don't look at it. Look at the light. We're gonna switch it, so look at the light. Now don't look at the light. Look at this hand. Do you see this hand? Do you see? Do you see this hand? You need to listen. Look at this hand. Do you see? Look at this hand. Okay, now don't. Don't. Don't look at my hand. Look at the light, okay? Don't look at my hand. Now look at Snorlax in your glass eye. Do 
Now, please blink your eye. Blink your eye four times, ready? One, two, three, four. Okay, now I'm going to test your eyesight really quick. So, have you seen this? Have you seen this? Have you seen this? I want you to read this. This last line, yeah, it says you chart six feet away from eyes in a good light. So I'm gonna hold it very far away from you. Can you read this? Can you read this? No, it's way too far away. Okay, then you feel the test. We can do it a little bit closer though. Can you read this? That's wrong, unfortunately. What is this? Okay, you don't know. Why didn't you tell me you couldn't read before we started the eye test? Okay, let's move on. So, what color is this? And what color is this? Alright, well you got that part right at least. Um, yeah, I don't think that this is related to your toe. Obviously, we're doing a little bit of a cranial nerve exam to see if there's any damage to your cranial nerve from your toe infection. But so far, it seems like you just might have some separate issues on your own, sadly. So, let's see. I mean, not sadly. You're going to be okay, obviously. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I am a little judgy as a doctor. It's just how I am. It's just how I roll. So, next up, I need to test your hearing. So, let me get my doctor hearing tools ready. You see this? Well, do you see this with your good eye? I want you to tell me what side you hear the chime ready? Listen, listen up. And I'm gonna switch. What side? What side? That was a test right in front. What side? One side. Well, your hearing seems fine. Honestly, it seems like you can hear a lot better ever since I cleaned out those ears. There was so much wax in them. I could not believe it. Ready? One more time. That one was a little loud to hear. One more time. No, you're not supposed to look at me switching the side so you know what side it's on. You're supposed to close your eyes. Close your eyes. Let's do it one more time. Okay, and what side? And one more time. What side? Alright, so yeah, you can hear fine. Clearly, there's nothing wrong with your ears other than the fact that they were a very very waxy but we took care of that because luckily i'm a nice doctor we're just going to do another hearing test really quick see this little egg this is this egg shaker hmm? i want you to tell me when it's closer and farther away okay ready is it closer or farther away Is it closer or farther away? Close your eyes. Your eyes should be closed. Closer or farther away? Closer or farther away? And closer or farther away. Okay, okay. Now look at the eggs. Look at the eggs. Look at the eggs. I'm just gonna shake them on your face. Just for fun. <laughs> okay, so now we need to test your feeling. I have this little device right here. First, I'm going to go on your face. 
I'm gonna do soft or hard. Obviously, then we need to test your toe and your feet. But first, we need to check the nerves in your face. So you see this? You need to tell me is it soft or hard? Soft or hard? Soft or hard? Do you feel anything? You do. Okay, you need to tell me that. Soft. Alright, no cheating. Stop looking. Soft or hard? Soft or hard? Soft or hard? And soft or hard here? Okay, and soft or hard here? And soft or hard here? Soft or hard? And soft or hard? Oh, sorry, that was a little loud. Yeah, it's weird that you're made of metal. Like, okay. Soft or hard? And soft or hard? Now, let me see those little feetsies. Um, you can get a little closer now. Here. Hold on, hold on. Move your little feet. Move your little feet. Oh, you have big feet. Okay. Oh my god, it fell over. So, let me see. I'm gonna take your first foot. I'm just going to remove it and pull it up here a little bit. So, I'm going to test on your toe. Ready? Softer hard. Okay, you don't have feeling, but I thought this was your good toe. Come on, pay attention. Softer hard. Okay. Let's just do a feeling test. Tell me if you can't feel any of the areas. Mm -hmm. Alright, let me switch to this one. Yeah, you have other ones fine. This is the one of the injury. So, does this hurt? A little bit. Can you feel here? When I do this, can you feel this? You can't. Okay. Can you see? Softer arm. Can you feel this? Okay, yeah, there's definitely a problem with your big toe. I've never seen a toe so flexible and you can't feel it. That's a little weird. Um, yeah, so I think you have a toe infection. And your toe might be broken, so I'm going to tell you to just rest your toe. And not walk on it. Don't step on it for two months. And I'm gonna give you some medicine to treat your toe infection. So let's see. First, I'm gonna take this and just give you a little injection, okay? It won't hurt. It's just gonna go right here. All around your toe. And I'm gonna have to give you some oral medications as well for that infection. But like I said, just rest your toe here. I'm gonna wrap it in some gauze. Okay. Let's wrap it up. Wrap your toe. Just like this. There we go. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Alright, you can move a little farther away from me now. Let me just. Move you back, take this foot and move you back. Now I'm gonna give you some medications. Let me just prepare my medications for you. Just one moment. So, time for your treatment. I'm gonna give you a shot in your face. And a couple more. This is instant medication, so it will help your infection immediately. Here's some medicine. Swallow this. Swallow this. And swallow this. And swallow this. And swallow this. Okay, you should be feeling better soon. Like I said, stay off of this little toe. Stay off of this toe for 
two months. You can't walk on it, okay? Because if you do, you're just going to you're just gonna reactivate the injury and then we're not gonna have a good time and then I'm gonna have to come back in here and see you and I have a lot more plans going on. I'm super busy. I'm so sad I get dinner tonight. And I probably can't help you, so we might have to send in a different doctor who is not as qualified in the big toe. So I hope that I was able to help you out. Do you have insurance? You don't have insurance. Okay, it's gonna be $50,000, but no need to worry. We have payment plans. They can check you out at the front desk. Okay, I hope that you feel better soon. I mean, if, you're, if your toe is hurting, don't call me, like I said, I'm gonna be really busy, but you can call the hospital and they'll probably take care of you. Mm -hmm. Alright. Bye bye. I will see you hopefully never. Mm -hmm. Bye.